Hello, everybody. As always, my name is Dan. <sighs> it's been uh, a while. Yep, so that's really all I'm going to say. Bridge Project, a, I would assume, sequel to Bridge, or, yeah, Bridge It, which was, I believe, made by NVIDIA as a demonstration for PhysX. Uh, all of that information may or may, 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 or may not be true. Uh, I particularly don't know, uh, but I did play it. So this is basically the same premise. You have a bridge to build, you have material, uh, and you have to make sure that it doesn't fail. So this is going to be a complete playthrough, so this might take a while, because uh, all of these noob levels are uh, well, in abundance. So... Yeah, we're going to be watching this for a while. All of the easy levels. So hopefully we'll just get through it real quick. Just like simple, simple things. So I turned on stress so we can see uh, how close our bridge is to failing. You can see that uh, it is about to fail. Imminent failure ahead. And of course we... Pass through that, just the longevity of that bridge is probably never going to last. So, yay, we did it. Next level, oh boy. I'm just gonna do all of the rurals and then the cities and so on and so forth. Uh, so, yeah, this is basically all we're gonna do in the game. If you guys like physics simulators that uh, are basically revolved around you influencing the uh, building of a structure that would affect something. Well, it's not exactly affecting anything. It's more or less just a, a little fun physics simulator. So, of course, we're just going to take the simple approach of building structural supports and then using cables to hold it up. Uh, we really don't need cables along here because everything's being pulled down. Now, of course, if we had a, a little bit more structural resilience over here. Over here, maybe we would have combined them, but that'll suit for uh, now. Then you can see the stress is going away. Of course, the stress is always bugged out as soon as you start it up. So, relatively simple. All these tests. Made sure that the simulation speeds all the way up because I can't be bugged to uh, watch these things travel at their normal speed. Which is like two miles an hour. I can walk across that fucking bridge faster than that. And now we're starting to get a little bit more complicated with a little bit more distance between two of the sides. So, just gotta first span the roadway across. I'm glad that at least we didn't get down into this stuff yet. We could still use crossbars. Crossbars, I like to disable when we're building bigger bridges and I have a higher overhead stuff because buses and cars drive into it which isn't very pleasant so yeah here I'll just do a quick s snippet that's like normal speed that takes forever so on the left you've got incoming so there's two buses that weigh three tons each that are really stressing the bridge but it hasn't moved, it's just extremely stressed out. And then these cars, cars really don't do anything. Passed with flying colors, oh boy. Yay. Congratulations, level completed. Yeah, this is the real exciting stuff. Now we're just gonna rush through this. Uh, ooh, suspension. Suspension's always fun. Oh, you got these large things above here, and then you lower it like that and uh, let's use some iron for a roadway so we'll get a little bit more resilient with our materials so now we have four sections with three breakaway points so now we gotta cover that so this to that this to that and this to that and we could add on to it but we really don't need to at least I don't think I think we'll be good enough. That thing's just bouncing around a lot. Yeah, it'll be fine. No, no worries. We got 
Oh, well, the buses might do it in. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at that thing wobble. And this thing's flashing. That's not good when it's flashing. Oh, no. Whoops. Whoops, 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 whoops. That's not going on my recipe. Maybe just a little, a little bit more cabling. Yep, just more cabling. Everything's good. We're all good. Yep, look. No problem. No problem. Don't turn on the auto action cam. Oh! Oh! Oh, that was really sketchy. Oh, that was not pleasant. Oh, this might break it. Please, please don't break. Oh my god. Okay, uh, our first failure of this series is, that was pretty bad. Now you get the really bad things, and also, I see on the left, well, in the mission briefing, we have a boat, boat coming in. So, now, in, uh, integrating the concept of boats, so... I don't think it's the same same mechanic. Well, it sort of is the same mechanics except for how to make uh, breakaway joints for uh, Bridget. So, yeah, we're just going to make support so we can get our uh, bridge lifted up. I'll just throw this over here. This over here. We need that to be the supporting and then we got this which also needs to be over here this will go there so go up here this here this here that goes there and now we have this you just right click on it and click open joint now you take pistons and it only works if you have pistons going off to one side if you have piston pistons going straight up it doesn't work so basically that'll be how it works the boat will go right over there and let's see everything's being stressed out Normal, yep. Hopefully they don't drive in any cross beams that I forgot to disable. Everything looks good, and here comes the boat. Just rising up. Now oh, that thing's all flipping out. Now it's not as stressed out. Now it lowers. Possibly did a little bit of insight on this game beforehand. AK, like 10 minutes of playing it to see if it's still the same thing. We got heavy buses, which is going to fuck up my day. Yeah, it's a really sketchy bridge, but it looks good. It looks like a professional bridge. Yep. Rural map number six. Oh, this is the really sketchy thing. So, they, these uh, towers don't... Oh, these towers do provide support. I I got up to this map before, and I never noticed that this thing had uh, actual supports. So... Just... Uh, right there, works. And... We still have a lot of suspension cables left, so we can uh, add on. And now we can do double wide decks, so that's always useful. Now, cables, I mainly like using cables. Deselect. Uh, cables are very helpful, so I'm going to connect these two sections to the top. Just a little bit of stability and everything connects like this and I think everything should be fine and dandy yep now we have buses coming up first also we have a train and trains are heavy as fuck stop honking yes I know Oh, this is holding up a lot better than the first time I did it. I had a little bit of problems here. 
because I didn't notice that those were there. Learn something new every day. And here comes the fucking train. Chug, 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 chug. Here comes death to my bridge. <laughs> it's definitely not a, uh, a uh, train bridge. <laughs> Yay. Next. Rural number seven. Okay, so we have another boat. Another boat to deal with. Oh, this is the one that I hate. Hate to love. Okay, so. We go here. And I don't know where the boat comes from, so I think it comes from. Or comes into play, like right here. And I'll be. I'll be a gentleman, and I will have this support, so. Let's see. First. Go up to. Now we can just redistribute our forces. Something like that. Did I do that? Nope. Okay. Well, actually, that looks really stupid. No. Just throw that up there. So now we have a lot of support coming in here. Oh yeah, we gotta watch. Uh, you have to watch out for this. We have cross beam. Oh, oh well, yeah, auto cross beams. These things get formed, and they look like they're fine, but they're not. Buses and cars hit them. I don't think trains do because they ride in the middle. So we gotta delete them and disable cross beams, which is really annoying. It's a really stupid mechanic, but oh well, really can't do anything about it. So in order to do that, you have to have your advanced structures enabled, and you gotta do it. Mark, so, okay, now that that's done, uh, we actually have to throw this over here. So, this is really sketchy. Then we have pistons. These pistons will go all the way down there. We switch back to the steel. Steel really are only going up. I forgot to split that. Now, this is just going to be basically support for this part. Basically identical sides. And yeah, this is actually where you want the cross beams to be. So, just delete them, re-enable them, and redo it. Although it uses more steel than a conventional non-whatevers. So, I'm do this. Just form a triangle. The mystical triangle always works. And then just do this. Hopefully that'll work. Yep. A lot of stress. This thing has a lot of support. Or a lot of weight to carry. Everything's coming down. And here comes the failure. Yeah, that's, that's brutal. Now this thing has to lift. Yep. Called it in the middle. This thing will lift up. It really doesn't have to lift up that far because this thing will pass under this bridge almost completely so yeah this is this is why I have the cross beams enabled with this thing this thing will just twist and turn and break and fall apart real quick now everything's just going all wonky don't know why this thing can close just like how we want it to hopefully sometimes it bugs out like real bad you don't know why. And hopefully thing, everything will settle down. Not everything settling down. Oh, that's getting really wonky. That's getting really wonky. Oh, oh. That's really bad. And the cars, cars are pish posh. Really easy. They don't sound like cars though. 
But it's a really sketchy dip. So yay, we finished. Yay. We congratulations, route level complete. Yay. Thank you. Bro map number eight.